Hello and welcome, it's S tier Rank. I'm gonna hop into inscription, just had a false start to the stream a moment ago with a audio difficulty, but let's go ahead and hop back in. Okay, back to P3O's mission. I can't remember if I was heading left or right, so let's just head to the right. Okay, good. So we already did that, and now we're heading out to some of the puzzle room area, I'm supposing. It's wanted me to go get a battery, but we'll see if we can get into some shenanigans. You're allowed an inspection room only. Let's get me the battery for the inspectorometer and come back. Okay. Um, print progress. Hmm, I wonder if this is a card I can get. Nothing to use, it looks like. Well, it's watching me, isn't it? Aha! Some puzzles to play. Okay, can't move either of those, so they're staying. Um, let's see, how are we looking here? I don't think it that could possibly work. Maybe we're meant to go down this way. No, it's definitely this way that I'm trying to attack. Okay. Now, curious, I think this might be the explodey dude, so I wonder, yeah, that does better. Okay. Let's see if this gets it. Nope. There we go. Mrs. Bond's remote, sure, take it. Drop bombs on every empty space. Tactical board wipe. Don't be stupid about it. Well, that'll be nice. Okay. Alright, we're scoring a 3 out of 5 already. Okay. This one looks like it's locked into place. Not sure on this one. We'll just kind of work our way across it. I'm not seeing it. Immediate five out of five. I'm not sure what these symbols do, anyways. Hmm. Looks like things were better when we were way up like this. These are not doing any damage ones as zeros, I believe, so I'm gonna keep that. So this three is actually getting all the damage for us. So what are these other guys doing? I wonder if they're spreading offensive powers or something like, it almost looks like those little magic orbs. Um, or that, or I wonder if we're talking about a circuit here. Interesting. Notice how I we'll move up here and I get an extra damage. I wonder if these are conducting damage across the way. So take that out and just get one. Makes me think it has to be something like this. Hmm. I feel like I'm missing something obvious in this one. 
me back out for a second. I'm gonna see what else there is. Ah, here we go. Maybe we can see the symbol. Yeah, it looks kind of like Mox's. Detonator sniper, armored, overclocked, bomb latch, brittle latch, chill latch, dead bite. <laughs> Hostage file, transformer, sentry, gem detonator, that's what it is. Gem vessels on the car owner's side of the board die, they detonate the creature opposing them as well as adjacent friendly creatures for 10 damage. Okay. So, we're getting three because these guys shouldn't be attacking though. Okay, I guess this one is blowing up, which is then blowing up these dudes, blowing up this guy, it's somehow getting three damage out of all of it. So, theoretically, this one is fixed, okay. Maybe if I go down like this. Okay, not there. Let's try moving this guy in. Well, I don't quite understand how that works. Um, but for sure, this would get it. Keep playing with it for another minute or two. Alright, let's think again. So this one's blowing up, taking out that one. It's this symbol that throw me off. Maybe I need to figure out what that is first. Hmm. Oh, I bet that's what's in there, nano armor generator. Looking for a kind of diamond shaped thing. Nothing yet. Maybe it's an orange mox. Provides an orange gem to its owner. Yeah, that's what it is. So it's a gem detonator, an orange mox. Okay. I wonder if detonating all of these helps get rid of this guy perhaps play with it a little bit longer but I'm just not seeing it just trying to kind of roughly brute force my way through now Okay, so it makes a lot of sense that this is happening because there's a chain reaction, so boom, boom, boom. Presumably boom up here too. Okay, so that took one off. Now can't get rid of that guy. Hmm. So So we got two and then a whole bunch of different ways this could go. Alright, well, I'll think about it. I'll let those things turn off. That's fine, just saw some easy puzzles.
Rotate the sigil until it is upright. Oh. Mm -hmm. Just like some of those uh, modern captures on some websites. I don't know about this one. Assume it's like that. It's like all squares that contain cards. <laughs> yeah, this is totally like captures. I love it. It's like all squares that contain cards. Um, that's looking a little bit more broken. It's like a creepy building on the outside or something. Ah, fish spot. Found me. Good. Robot fish hide me. Revenge for last time. Bad fish. <laughs> oh, what is this guy? Okay. I think that's the energy thing that 3PO was wanting. Or P3O. Yep, that's it. Bring it over. Alright. Just a second. You gotta try your silly puzzle again. Can't give up. Now, why does that make a difference? So, it's gotta be because of that one attack. And now it'll be two attack. I can't get rid of that one. if it explodes. Alright, let's see. So go to zero to three. I wonder if it's exploding boom 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 and getting three like that. Let's see. Does it go down to one? So it just gets a one. So if this blows up and that blows up, and this and that, am I getting three because of this guy? No. Well, actually, it could be because this is doing over damage in that case. There we go. So we got four in this position, but why? Because we're getting a little extra damage. Okay. Okay, so this is exploding, but still having enough attack power. So what would make this work? Gotta be this one down here. No. Oh, I'm so close earlier. Let's try again. So why is that getting us four? So, this one to take out that one, but it doesn't explode. This one takes out that one, and it does explode. Hmm. I think I'm missing an obvious solution, but oh well. We'll just go back to it. We at least got one advantage for this next round. I should do it. Back to the game. Alright, we're in Eastern Botopia. Here we go. Revolting. 
Yeah, sorry that you have to see this. It's the last area in Botopia that still has life in it. A stinking, squirming mass of imperfection. Hmm, I assume that's a fight. Hmm, Sonia. Transform at the beginning of your turn. A card bearing this sigil will transform to or from beast mode. Well, that sounds interesting. Let's do it. For that fight, oops, I want to go to the left. It's like something interesting. I wonder if this is an encounter of some sort. But no, you came in uh, just the wrong time. This generator is about to explode or something. You have to recharge it before that happens. It's a race against the clock, you'll see. Fleshy fish is something you must find other scribe fish to deep beneath. Okay. Annoy FM. Alright. When my face says zero, you lose. I assume I just have to destroy these two things. Um, okay. Bait. Yes, you are for right now. I think I want to have just enough turns that I won't be able to make this. Let's try putting this here and see what happens. Running out of time. Alright, I could put the 49er down. That's going to take a lot of turns to run though. Um, sector drone. Kind of the same story, but I guess let's just see if it works or not. Um, I could possibly. No, it's got two on its power. Okay. Okay, good. Oh, and I've got to charge this thing up, so I wonder if it's just attacks, period. So I need to get rid of the empty vessel and put down the 49er. Let's see what this shield will have. One, three, five cost. So let's just see what happens. And that's the best we can do, so let's see. Okay, so in one turn we had to make it up. A gift bot. What's inside of you? Phantom cards creating your hand. Alright. Perhaps we'll have just enough energy that it'll be something that can do some good hitting. A shield bot. Well, maybe that'll be enough. So one, two, three, four damage. I don't think it's gonna be enough. Come on! Fuck! Oh, okay. Well, I guess I got lucky there. You charged it before it exploded. I get a clap for you, I would. <laughs> well, that was nerve wracking. Okay, good. Um, I forget what this one does, if it's like a sacrifice or not. Actually, I think it just infuses it with, at least before it did, an, an additional sigil, I think. So, 
Thinking that maybe one of the lower power guys would be good. Perhaps a sniper bot would be good since it only has one defense. I think I'll do that. Let me calibrate. Okay. Stinky would be a good idea, but it's only got one HP, so. Burrow and empty space will be struck. Card bearing a sigil moved that space to see the strike instead. Yeah, it's not very good for sniping. Maybe Gift Bearer would be the best. Stinky would help it a little bit on longevity, but getting another um, sigil or another card I think sounds like the best idea. Okay. And let's continue on our way. Let's see, is this uh, called quit or something like that? Okay. Um, I do want to try the bomb thing, but I think I'm going to hold out a little bit longer. at least put down a vessel for some defense. Defense. Oh, it turned into a transformed mode. Looks like it's now more powerful. We've got a bolt hound that's incoming. Maybe it would be a good idea to test out this exploder thing. Opened up the map a little. Okay. Hmm. This fish bot would be a good one to take on the Q U one seven seven. Um yeah, let's do this. Sentry drone might be a good idea for Sonia though. Do you have three energy, so I think that I'll have to do something like that. There we go. And how about we do a vessel right here, because we know that that's going to get stronger. And I think that'll work for now. Okay. Now, let's see, you have an explode bot that we could just go ahead and put right over here. And thinking that might be about it after the energy bot. There we go. Now when Sonia comes in, it'll die. Explode bot should get that one over there. Oh, another bandit out to get me. Oh, honey, don't cry. I'm Crash Casey. I'll make it swift. Oh boy, another mercenary. It does a hit power of two. All right. This one has quills as well. Hmm. Maybe getting Fishbot down would be the wisest thing. Okay. And we'll use Shieldbot to stand up to the quit. And that will be it. All right. 
gift bot. We'll put it in the way of this one. And we're going to get Insector Drone to take out this guy. Oh, and of course Insector Drone is going to overshoot Bad Fish. Brittle after attacking a card bearing sigil perishes. Annoying creature opposing card bearing sigil gains one power. Well. That yeah, sounds useless. <laughs> okay. Ah, double gunner. Alright, sorry, but we're going to have to sacrifice you, buddy. And... I guess having the bad fish will at least... Could at least be played as a blocker for that one, but... I need to replenish my HP for that. Or my energy. Okay. And that's it. All right, sentry drone. I think explode bot. We'll do this number here and see if it works. Oh, not looking good for me. I think that's probably it for me. GG. Oh man, it reset my money too. Well, that sucks. Makes me more determined to figure out this dang puzzle. I feel like there's just gotta be a simple explanation to this. This one get four. This one gets three. It's just adding one attack power. And it suddenly breaks it off for some reason. Hmm. There's also a gear piece here. What are these gears doing? No, it looks like it's just the lane difference. Okay. Thought maybe that was something I was missing all along. Oh well. Don't want to waste too much more time on it. Let's see where we're at. Let's try heading south this time. Uh, the dank scrapyard is pretty unpleasant. Its inhabitants grasping claws seek fresh bots. Watch your ankles. Hmm, guess I can't get that yet. Alright, we got the fish bot again. Leap bots and a shield latcher. Shield latch. When a card bearing a sigil perishes, its owner chooses a creature to gain the nano armor sigil. Well. 
We'll just block him off for a minute. Got some dead trees in the way. And it exploded by. Hmm. Okay. Let's go ahead and get Exploded Bot on the map. Okay. We have Shield Latcher and an Exploded Bot. Perhaps using that would be the best thing, so... Could we maybe put down a Double Gunner next turn? about just putting on a cheap sentry drone and an empty vessel here, okay? Ah, uh, now it has the nano shield on it. I see. What a game. Armor the first time a card bearing sigil would take damage, prevent that damage. Good thing is, is it can't fight back in this moment. We have a double gunner that's incoming. It's never good. Good thing is it only takes one hit. I well, we could put a sniper in its way. There we go. Got down. I am fish. <laughs> yes, you are. Ah, oh, darn. That's not good. Did not expect that path. There we go. Another shield latcher. Oh good, I got a uh, shield on. Good. That wasn't terrible. Skelly Latcher. Brittle Latch. When the card brain of sigil perishes, its owner chooses a creature to gain the brittle sigil. Ah, that doesn't sound good. Alarm bot. Annoying creature. Opposing creature. Uh, the creature opposing a card bearing is gains one power. And that shield latcher, which we just saw. Um, yeah, I don't like the brittle. Sounds like that could get in the way of my own cards. Well, the owner chooses, so maybe I can play it against them. We'll try it out. Exoskeleton. It's brittle. Okay. Good. Definitely want to block one of those out. Okay. Now, how about... Explode bot feels pretty good actually. Let's do it. <coughs> That'll clear up that lane for us as well. Okay. Another exoskeleton. isn't looking good from an energy perspective. Let me do this, and maybe that'll be good enough to uh, block some of this heat that's coming my way. Okay. We 
could throw down a shield bot. That'll survive the sentry. Take it out. Okay. Another exoskeleton incoming. I guess we'll hold off on those offensive ones, but maybe we can put down an energy pot at least. Yeah, we could use the offensive one too, I suppose. And there we go. Oh, the sun is a bat. Cool. That's really cool. Okay. Do that for now, and then we'll put a sentry down next, most likely. Central only works when it's a new one put into it. So, fortunately, it would just be fodder. So, let's do this, I guess. All right, fish pot, your turn. Let's try it out and see how it works. Here we go. And that'll clear the board for me, I think. Oh. I won anyways. You wish to pass this ice? Well, I suppose I could clear it. A little bit of heat should do the trick. Hey, <laughs> hey. All right, let's see what's over here first. I'm not the trader or anything, but there's going to be a little give and take here. You have to trade one of your cards for one of these. Hmm. I do kind of like the idea of using these exoskeletons. Let's try it. Okay, what will you give me? How about... Oops. How about a sentry? I think that's a good trade. Four Robobux. I don't guess it costs that much to get whatever that is. Hmm. Automaton and a bomb latcher. So we want to get rid of it pretty quickly. There we go. That's what we need. Explosion bot. Okay. See what sigil. It's a detonator one. All right. Got to think of a good way of taking it out without being a big problem. I 
Might as well send an ex exoskeleton out after it. That might be a good way to get rid of the double gunner. Hmm. Perhaps the shield bot from the gunner. We'll put this here to block some damage. Well, not enough. Okay. Well. Has it been the most successful day on this? It's been a hard run. Looks like the ice is cleared though. That's cool. That let me bypass one of the fights. <laughs> I come back to where I was now. All right, let's see. Okay. I suppose a 49er might be a good idea. Save me a little bit of an attack there. Wish I could see. There we go. Let's try to see the energy I had. All right. Sasonia, how do we want to do this? Hmm. Perhaps an energy buy here. There we go. This isn't looking good. I wonder how to gonna have to go to the west, Batopia or something. Oh hum. And let's see, I guess sending out Sonia could work too. Double gunner is gonna come after me anyways. Okay, now the bat Sonia should take that out right away. And let's see what we have. Sniper. Good. So we can go with that. Nice. I'm gonna take out the automaton on the next round. Too bad I couldn't wait a little bit longer, but really need it to go. Okay. Um Shield bot's gonna be a problem. Gonna get too much damage on me. Could get the double gunner out. But it's weak. Guess I'll do this. It should give us just enough to take them out. There we go. Actually, I'm not sure how it's still alive. That's weird. Maybe, oh, it's because the Seto drone was shooting in the back. Duh. Shot over it. Okay. Hmm. Guess we want to shoot it here. There we go. Okay then. I 
guess we'll put you in fish spot. What else should we get into? There we go. Send this one on. Nice, and that gets me a free lane. Which I definitely need. Okay, that might make the difference. Good. <laughs> well, I got turned around quite a bit. Hey, a new waypoint. Filthy corpse world. <laughs> All right. What a depressing abode. You have to be here to defeat the resident Uberbot. I don't think you'll want to stay long. This is a cool one. I'll overclock one of your cards, but it. Hey, one of your cards give an attack buff. Okay. If it dies, it's gone forever. Interesting. I wonder if Fishbot would be a good one. It does have three health. We'll do it. Overclocked. Card bearing sigil has increased power, but if a card bearing sigil perishes, it's permanently removed from the deck. It's only one plus. Well, you're gonna get it. Done. Don't let it die. That explains the little lightning bolts that I saw in those other cards. They were overclocked. A me bot. Amorphous. When a card bearing sigil is drawn, the sigil is replaced with another sigil at random. Hmm. That may be useful. Ready to trade? Alright. How about... Bomb Latcher. We will trade out... They can explode by well, I don't know. And this is a hard one. Perhaps the I don't know, the scaling launcher is pretty good. The cost so stinks. Maybe we'll do scaling launcher. Uh oh. Wonder if that was a pelt. Okay. All right, we have Leap Bot and the Shield Latcher coming in. We'll play it like this. Gunner could go here. Would be a reasonable spot for it. Explode bot could also be handy. Take out the leap bot, perhaps. Here we'll go like that. And That'll be it. All right, bomb latcher. We'll 
we'll go ahead and do this. And we will put down Explodey Guy. I think I can just blow him up, right? <laughs> Alright. And that's that. Oof. It's getting close. Alright. Double gunner. Don't have enough. We have enough for a shield bot, though. I think that's going to be our closest way through this. So let's do that. And let's put down an energy bot. And hope for the best. Okay. Now, let's see. Need to figure out how to get the insectodrome. So, double gunner. We'll be able to get it on the next turn. I think that'll be the best thing to do. Okay. Oh, duh. Should have been watching out for the one attacking. Man, definitely not thinking of that one clearly. Alright, is this a touch of death? Yep. Now that might be good for Leap Bot, assuming it can go all the way through its damage. Okay. There we go. Now what else? An insecto drone is coming in. Hey, the sniper bot. Good, that's one of my favorites so far. We will take out one of those pesky guys away over there. Good, the 49er. <laughs> That's a good excess. Ah, a well. And some sort of item. And some money. Oops. Let's go back. Hmm. Some sort of timer. You brought a fine quill. Please sign here that you agree to give access. Thank you. Do not forget your agreement. Looks like another waypoint. The items are back online. Bot Sprawler is offline. The Dank Crypt. There it is. The Uberbot you saw it. These idiotic librarians worship it as it sits here covered in filthy grime. Ready to clean it up. Oh look, it's boss time. Unpacking archivists.zip. Applying personality matrices. Cleaning up some tent files. Okay, here we go. Ah, greetings. You had not cleaned from the title of my zip file. I am the archivist. Pretty creepy. Eagerly await the opportunity to explore your hard drive. Files and directories are my specialty, you see. Good fish. <laughs> Got some power on you. You're over clock now, aren't you, fish bot? Okay. Well, I wonder how we're going to get rid of the tombstones. I wonder if a bomb can do it. Librarian's dead bite. When the card brain sigil perishes, select this file, place damage on the scales according to the file size. Uh. Well, that sounds dangerous. I like the backgrounds of the files flying around. I guess we'll just start with this. Not much else of a choice. 
Okay. Maybe I really can see an explode bot. Hmm. Oh, I should have inquired sooner. You'll need to grant me access to your hard drive. Would you please acquiesce? Sure, you no harm will come of it. Oh boy. Here we go. Here comes your actual files. Hope no one is watching. Now, do recommend an exemplary file to me. I do take into account its size, its magnitude, its its bulk. Oh boy. This is an actual file thing. Um we're gonna go in here. We'll do this. Small file, but I do suppose respectful. Single point of damage is what it's worth. Okay. So, energy bot, fish bot, Sonia. Oh my. I guess parking a double gunner in front of the tombstones is an ideal situation. There's half two, so I could just keep taking them down. I'm afraid that I'm going to lose them, though. Definitely not an ideal situation, but we're going to try it. Again, choose a file. So I'll say this will be paramount. All right, how about we'll go in our chipset drivers again, and we'll try this one. Diminutive, yes, yet yeah, enough to burden the skills. Okay. Ah, oh, good, an exoskeleton. So let's put it here. This realized I should have been giving it big ones and that would have given me damage, darn it. Uh, I didn't understand that interpretation. I guess I'm getting sleepy or something. How about we do this? And it won't matter. Should have not wasted that. Alright, let's get a file. Measure bytes. Darn it, I did not mean to click that one. Okay. So, one of these has got to be kind of big. Come on, a big AMD driver of some sort. Hey, this one's big. <laughs> I say it's colossal, bravo. <laughs> okay. Me up. All right, double gunner. I think it's up to you, bud. All right, and yeah, I guess we need to do this too. Okay, let's see how it goes. How big of a file can we find? Page file is big too. Nice. It's gargantuan. 
All right, another file. How about Xbox games? Nope, nothing there. Uh, let's see. Surely there'll be something in the Windows folder. Let's look for, let's see, no, that's not that big. Games, nope. Program data. Nope, don't think so. Um, Let's see if there's something big in here. Surely there's something big. Visual Studio. There we go. That's gonna have something chunky. Only 51 megabytes. We'll use it. Hopefully that's enough. Just follow the man's attention. Appears away in it about two damage. Bravo. Oh no. Okay, second phase. This one, however, is very special. Choose a file that is dearest to your heart and one that shows age. Okay. That definitely would be in the Windows install. Surely there'll be something older in there. 614. 2019, 2017, there's one. You didn't choose file that was too dear, did you? For if this card dies, I'll delete this file from your disk. Please don't not tip me, I'm completely serious. Let's see what that looks like. Oh. This, this file is most ancient indeed. <laughs> it has seen things. The stat line of 404 is only appropriate for an august file such as this. <laughs> All right, I love it. All right, a whole bunch of dead trees. Well, how do we get past that? I guess a gunner is gonna help. This is, this is the end of fish spot too, unfortunately. All right. Let's just wanna say hostage file and a card bearing sigil perishes the file. Use to create is really deleted from your hard drive. Huh? That better not happen. That'll probably crash my machine. Well, there goes Fishbot for good. Yes! Well, you don't. won't be seeing that one again. <laughs> good fish. Wow. Yeah, you gotta try that. I'm glad I did this upgrade. This is hilarious. Look at all those stats. Sentry, Quill, Sniper, and um, Airborne Defense. Jeez. I put them behind the tree to prevent some damage. And a Brittle Latch. Oh, there we go. I had you. Oh well. Needed a few credit deck building decisions, I guess. And you're lucky. Give me my Robux. Remember your side deck? That useless thing with all the anti vessels? It's about to get less useless. Your pick will be installed on every entry vessel card. Okay. Ah, oh, quill sounds like a good idea. Fight back a little bit. Interesting. Not sure that was right, but they all have sharp quills now. Excellent. Let's 
memory card is full. Uh oh. Well, hello there, card gamers. Um, looks like my garage sale hunting days have finally paid off. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Wish you guys see this. You know what that is? You know what that is? Vintage packs of inscription. Four of them. I don't know if the woman knew what these are worth. I mean, I felt a little bad buying them off of her. But I mean, she's probably doing okay living in this part of town. I mean, it's like... It's a nice part of town, you know? And, uh, she would have thrown them away if I hadn't come by. Right? Right. Okay. Big pack opening video incoming! Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo! Mrs. Hobb. Um, listen, I was at your garage sale the other day, and I... No! No, everything's fine. Thank you. Um, I was just wondering if you remember those playing cards that you sold me? Those... Yes! Yes! Those ones. Inscription. Yes. They were your daughter's? Would it be possible for me to speak with her? She passed, isn't she? Oh, oh, no, I'm, I'm so sorry. Oh, it was a while ago. That's still terrible. Oh, it, it's nothing really. I'm, I'm sorry to have bothered you, ma'am. Her name is Casey. That's a lovely name. Sorry, what? She worked for Inscription? I mean, she worked for Gang Tuna? Ma'am, would it be possible? I see. Okay, yeah. Um, do you think it'd be all right if I called you back later? I'm just trying to get to the bottom of something. Okay. Okay, thank you so much. Okay. All right, have a good dinner. Bye. These articles mention death or injury. Oh my god. No one was killed at the facility, though tragically young video game developer Casey Hobbs died from fire related complications. Fuck. She was working late at the facility for performing quality assurance on behalf of her employer, Game Tuna. Someone is here. Fuck this. My phone's in the other room, so if I die before I can call 911, use this tape as evidence. Well, that was all kinds of creepy. Hmm. 
got through one more match and then I'll probably call it a stream for the day. Felt like I made good progress. Okay. So we have exoskeleton, sentry drone, exoskeleton, and a sentry drone. We'll just put out our explode bot there, take you out, and keep going. All right, let's see. What else can we get? Bomb latcher might be a good idea. Here we go. And we'll put you here. And that'll be it. All right, good old double cutter. Aha, that's my trap card. All right, sniper bot, it's your time to shine. Sniper bot. Excellent. <laughs> Hit the bottom on that pretty quickly. In a lot tour. That's the. Okay. Well, I think that that's where I'm going to call it a stream. So. Thanks for watching. You've been watching S Tier Rank. You can follow me on Twitch and Twitter at S Tier Rank, and I'll have a replay on YouTube soon. Thanks, and have a good one.